Take a moment, close your eyes, feel yourself sitting here, floor beneath your feet, chair or couch or something else beneath you. Take a deep breath in and out, in and out. We're going to grow roots from the base of our feet. We grow them down, down through the floor, down through the basements, into the soil far beneath our seats. We push them down throughout the soil, around the rocks, around the boulders. Push them down deep into the earth until we reach the bedrock far below. And when we reach that bedrock, to move out in search for the pools of water far beneath the earth, the cool, crisp waters of potential, the waters of chaos. When we find them, we're going to slowly bring those waters up and into our bodies. With each and every breath, we bring them up through our roots, bring them up into our feet and into our legs. As we breathe, the water comes further up into our loins and into our bellies. As we breathe further, it comes on up into our chests and into our heads. With the next breath, it comes up even further and pours out of our heads and out of our hands back into the earth. As if we're a fountain pulling these waters from far below, running the bodies and pushing them back into the earth. Rejoice in these waters and take part of these waters and fill yourself with these energies from far below. Now, let's turn our focus up and push branches up through our ceilings and up through our roofs. Push the branches up through the clouds and into the sky until we can find that star directly above our head. A point of light, the fires from above, the fires of order, fires of potential. We're going to reach up and pull these fires down, down into our branches. With each and every breath, we pull these fires down into our heads, into our chests. With each and every breath, these fires come down more into our bellies and into our loins, mingling with the waters we have from below. Pull these water fires down even further into our legs and into our feet. If you look at yourself, you're glowing, filled with the waters from below and the fires from above. Chaos and, and order, the powers of potential coursing throughout our bodies. Take of these powers all that you need. Fill your reserves. Bring yourself back to your center. Rejoice in these powers. And when you've taken all that you need, push the waters back down into the earth. Push the fires back up into the sky. Bring in your branches, bring in your roots, and disconnect from the waters and the fires. And know that if you ever need these energies ever again, you can always reach down, you can always reach up, and pull these into yourselves. But for now, take a deep breath in and out, in and out. When you're ready, open your eyes and join us, ready for the right. First, we give offerings to the Earth Mother. Earth Mother, you surround us and you support us. You aid us, you guide us. You provide us a place to live. You provide us food and sustenance. You provide us this amazing weather we've had the last few days and the nature that all surrounds us. 
Earth Mother, for all that you do for us. Earth Mother, accept our offerings. Earth, Earth Mother, Spirit, accept, accept our, our offerings. offerings. We're here to honor the kindred, the ancestors, the land spirits, and the shining ones. And we're here to ask for blessings in return from the kindred. But first, let us hallow our hallows. Are you well? You run deep into the earth. You connect us to the underworlds, to the lands of the ancestors. To you, we give you the silver. We say sacred waters flow within us. Sacred waters, sacred waters flow, flow within, within us. us. Mighty fire, you burn and transform. You send our offerings high into the sky, to the heavens, to the, sh to the shining ones. To you, we offer this incense. We say, sacred fires burn within us. Sacred, sacred fires, fires burn within, within us. A mighty tree, your roots run deep, far into the earth, to the wells below. Your branches run high into the sky, to the heavens above. Give you this water, we set you with, with this incense. We say, sacred tree, Grow within us. Sacred, Sacred tree, tree, grow within, within us. By the light of the water, the lights of the fire, our groves are made whole and holy. By the light of the water, the lights of the fire, our groves are made whole and holy. By the light of the waters and the lights of the fire, our groves are made whole and holy. So be it. So be shabby. Next, we call on the gatekeepers. Mighty gatekeepers, you who have aided us throughout the years, you have watched over us, you have guided us, you have taken our messages far and wide, and you have brought back what we needed to hear. To all of you that have aided us in this way, we call to you once more and ask you to aid us once more. Gatekeepers, accept our offerings. Gatekeepers, gatekeepers accept, our, accept offerings. our offerings. Now, gatekeepers, join your magic with ours. Let the well open as a gate to the underworlds. Fires open as a gate to the upper worlds. Let the tree to the crossroads between all the worlds open to our spirits and open to our voices. Let the gates be opened. Let the gates be opened. And let them be opened not only in my house, but in all of our houses. First, we make offerings to the ancestors. To all of you of our own kin, our family, those related by blood, we offer you welcome. To all of you of our chosen families, our inspiration, our mentors, our friends, we offer you welcome. And to all of you buried in this very earth, you were here long before us. We offer you welcome. Come, join us by our fires. Ancestors, accept our offerings. Ancestors, Ancestors accept our offerings. To the land spirits, be you fur and feather, scale and skin, our animal kin, we offer you welcome. Be you leaf and twig, stem and flower. Our plant kin, we offer you welcome. And be you of the unseen kin, the spirits of our homes and the spirits of our lands, we offer you welcome. Come, join us by our fires. Land spirits, accept our offerings. Land, Land spirits. spirits, accept our offerings. 
to the shining ones. The gods and gods of elder days, you who we call matrons and patrons, we offer you welcome. To the gods and goddesses of this very place, you were here long before us. We offer you welcome. To the gods and goddesses that watch over us, whether it's known or not, we offer you welcome. Come, join us by our fires. Shining ones, accept our offerings. Shining ones, accept, accept our offerings. At this point, if you have any offerings of your own to be made, please feel free to make them. I offer this to my gods for aiding me in the work done so far and in promise of the work that is still to come. all those who have been persecuted and affected through religious persecutions and to the people of Sri Lanka for what they are going through please send healing there are no further offerings to be made Mighty kindred, call upon you. We make offerings to you. We ask that you give us blessings and returns. And such we ask. Mighty kindred, accept our sacrifice. Mighty kindred, kindred accept, accept our sacrifice. Mighty kindred, we ask. What blessings do we receive? Ancestors, what blessings do you give us? They give us El House, the Elk, Elk Sedge, protection. Land Spirits, what blessings do you give us? They give us Storazos, the Thorn. Also defenses. The Shining One, what blessings do you give us? The Soizo, the Sun, Wholeness, Completions. It, it may sound weird, but the first thing I get out of this is wear sunblock. We're getting to sunny season again. In more seriousness, they've got our backs. They're watching over us and protecting us. Complete it. You can. Do we accept these omens? We accept these omens. We do most gladly. The mighty kindred in my glass and in all of our glasses. Fill our waters. Fill them with the omens we just heard. Fill them with Elahaz and protection of Elk Sedge. Fill them with Thorazaz and the defenses of the thorn. Fill them with Sozo and the sunlight and the wholeness and completion of the, of the day and of the sun. Behold the waters of life. Behold, Behold the waters of life. Uh, and now, let's thank all of those who have aided us tonight. Shining ones, be unknown to us, be of this land or be ones that we practice with on a daily basis. For all that you have done for us, for the omens that you have given us, shining ones, we thank you. Shining, shining ones, we, we thank, thank you. you. 
to the land spirits, view the animals, view the plants, or view the unseen kins. For all that you do for us, and for the omens that you have given us today. Land spirits, we thank you. Land spirits, we, we thank, thank you. Thank you. To the ancestors, you our personal family, be our chosen family, for be you of this very earth, for all that you have done for us, and for all, and for the omen that you have given us. Ancestors, we thank you. Ancestors, ancestors we, we thank, thank you. you. Gatekeepers, once more you have aided us and opened the ways. You've taken our messages far and wide. You've brought back what we needed to hear. You've watched over us and guided us as we've done our work. For all that you have done for us tonight, gatekeepers, we thank you. Gatekeepers, gatekeepers we, we thank, you. thank you. And now we ask that you join our ma your magic with ours once more. Let the waters, wells become but water once more. Let the fires become but flame once more. Let the tree become but a tree once more. Let the gates be closed. Let the gates be closed. Last but not least, Earth Mother, you surround us, you support us, you aid us, you nurture us. In some cases, you give us entertainment. For all that you do for us, Earth Mother, we thank you. Earth, Earth Mother, we, thank, we you. thank you. And go now, children of Earth, in wisdom and peace. For this rite has ended. <laughs>